Hey, so in today's vlog, we're going to talk about your competition. Like, what is your competition? Who are you competing against? And for most people, the answer to that would be that they're up against their friends, or maybe uh, they are competing against their friend circle, or their batchmates, their classmates, or their colleagues, maybe, or something like that. Uh, basically, the people in their vicinity, people around them, most people are competing with them, their peer group, basically. But the reality is that that's not your real competition. And even if you win that competition, it's not a big deal because you're just winning in a small group of people. So you should be. A real competition is the person who is the best in the world. In whatever you're doing, you have to compete with the person who is the best in the world. Okay, And that's why I feel that a school doesn't matter and college i'm not i'm not saying for the education part but the but how the system is structured that you're broken up in classes and batches and then you're ranked like who ranks first second and third because those ranks actually do not matter because those are only the ranks for your class or your school not the whole state or not the whole country and definitely not the whole world okay so there are so many people out there and you are actually up against all of them so that's your competition that whoever is the best in the world, you have to compete with that person and beat that person. That's your real competition. If you're competing with people around you, then that's not your competition. You're just fooling yourself. Even if you win that competition, that's not really winning. You're just winning in a small, very small match. Right? There's a difference between winning a cricket match in street cricket and winning a cricket match in international cricket. There is a world of difference between the two. So if you, if you do well in your class, that's good, but that's only like street level cricket. If you want to play world level cricket, then you have to go out and compete with the best in the world. So at whatever you do, it's not just about cricket. Whatever you're doing, if you're writing or if you're an influencer or if, if uh, you're dancing or you're doing whatever you're doing, if you're a business person, you have to compete with who is the best in the world. And if you're just competing with people around them, it's not going to help. So that's a real competition. The best in the world. Compete with those people. And it's not hard to find those people. The best in the world are always out there on the internet. You search who's the best in the world in whatever category you're working in and you will easily find them. Once you find them, you look uh, how they did what they did and try to do what they're doing and do it better. That's how you get better from the best and that's how you win from your real competition, the best in the world.